Christmas coming <laughs> early to Dollywood and Dolly Parton herself is there to celebrate. She officially opened Dolly's Smoky Mountain Christmas this afternoon. She knows how to make an entrance. <laughs> Does she ever? <laughs> 10 News anchor Beth Haynes joins us live from Pigeon Forge at the park. Beth, what a fun time today to kick off the season. You better believe it. Yes, she knows how to make an entrance and she definitely knows how to make the holidays festive for families all over the country. This is her 11th year hosting the Smoky Mountain Christmas and she's going bigger and better this year with a brand new Christmas expansion. Think 5 million lights. I do joked with Dolly earlier this afternoon that she definitely puts the sparkle in the holidays. I want to bring in Emily DeVoe because she is one of many members of the media today that got a preview of Glacier Ridge, the new attraction for Smoky Mountain Christmas. Yeah, this is the biggest expansion for a Smoky Mountain Christmas. Glacier Ridge adds a million lights. You know, they already had 4 million Christmas lights. This makes it 5 million. The centerpiece for Glacier Ridge will be a 50 foot tall Christmas tree that has animated light displays that do a synchronized show every half hour. The park was closed this week so they could finish putting the lights together, take down all the pumpkins from Pumpkin, Lu pumpkin Luminites, and you can see the park sent us this time lapse showing just how fast, how quickly they had to work to get this all ready for Dolly to light the tree tomorrow at 6 o'clock, open it to the public, and today she really just wanted to say thank you to all those employees who have spent countless hours getting this all ready for the Christmas season. It takes a lot of hard work to put all that together. So everyone at the park made it happen in five days after they closed down. That's amazing. Of course, in fact, there's still a lot of work to be done. There's a big team now still putting the final touches on Glacier Ridge. Dolly will be back tomorrow to light the Christmas tree at 6 o'clock. All right, so a lot of expansion here at Dollywood, a lot of preps for the holidays. She also is very busy with her production company, Dixie Pixie. They have two projects in the works with Netflix. Dumplin', which is a movie releasing December 6th. Her soundtrack, November 30th. Also, eight made-for-TV movies on Netflix, which will begin with Joe Lane next year. But I had a chance to get an update on the movie, the sequel we were all waiting for, 9 to 5. Actually, we're just about to read the first script, and then they'll make some changes, and hopefully that's going to be something we'll get to do sometime next year. We're hoping for that. After 40 years, we're doing a sequel. <laughs> nine to, so, uh, you know, remember I used to make the jokes, we better get after it, or we'll, it'll, we'll have to call it 95 instead of 925. <laughs> so the three of us, Lily, Jane, and I, are going to be working with three young women. Dolly says she is so looking forward to this reunion with those two ladies that she's become close with over the years with the 9 to 5 sequel. Well, coming up on 10 News at 6, we talk more Dollywood expansion beyond Glacier Ridge, which is for the Christmas holiday. We're talking what's to come next year and maybe even a new resort. Robin John, we'll send it back to you. That's coming up tonight at 6.